Why don't you call your product the Vetrolux 9000? Why would I call it that? I'm just trying to help. I know it's hard for you to come up with a name, what with your poor verbal skills. There's nothing wrong with my verbal skills. It only seems that way because my math skills are so high. There's no reason to get all Newswardic about this. He's more pultacious than Newswardic. Whatever that means, I am not. There, there. I know what you're doing. Your Scrabble mind games will not work on me. It's all very multipulous, if you ask me. Mm -hmm. uh -oh. mm. Why don't you call your product the Gruntmaster 6000? What kind of product do you see when you imagine a Gruntmaster 6000? Well, it's a stripped-down version of the Gruntmaster 9000, of course. But it's software upgradable. Can we just play? All right, then. Standard Scrabble rules apply. No kicking, biting, or slapping. No projectiles of any kind. Name calling? Only on your own turn. It. Give me four big ones, you wrinkled toad. Yes! Yes! It. That's not a word. I challenge. You challenge it? Give me the dictionary. What kind of stupid dictionary is this? Webster's? I think it's the one your company makes. That would explain it. Explain it? What's an it? Quixotic. That's triple word score plus 50 for using all seven letters, Q and the X, that's... 152 stinking totally lucky points. Woo! Woo! Yes! In your face, math boy! I am so tired of seeing that dance. Quizzing. That's 188. I'm pretty sure Scrabble only has one Z. That's the kind of thinking that allowed you to lose 400 games in a row. <laughs>